right, next up we have Tim. Uh, Tim, while you're coming up here, what is your favorite version of the game tag? Of the what now? The <laughs> game <laughs> tag. Sorry, I didn't hear you. Yeah. Freeze tag, for sure. Me too. <laughs> Thank you. All right, hold on real quick. Everybody say hi, Mom. There you go. Okay, cool. All right, so this is tag your it. Great question. Um, today we're going to talk about being lazy, because that is one of the greatest things ever, and I greatly appreciate every bit that I get to do of that. So we're going to talk about how you get to be lazier later. So what even is tagging? That's a great question. Thank you for asking. <clears throat> tagging is a very, very simple thing that you can start doing today to save yourself a whole lot of issues down the road. So what is a tag? It's a filter. That's all it is. It's not some complex piece of technology. It is literally just a tiny piece of metadata that you attach to something in the cloud that you deploy that has a key and a value. What is it? Where is it? You've probably already seen these things inside of the cloud that you use today. Who deploys stuff in the cloud manually and completely ignores the tagging section? Come on, raise your hands. I know you are. I know you do. Everybody clicks right through past it. Stop doing that. Why should you care? I've already told you, you get to be lazy. It takes a little bit of work today to be able to be super lazy tomorrow and the next day and the day after. It will make your life easier in the long run if you just go through and start tagging your resources. Now, why? Why will it make your life easier? Folks in finance, like who's been yelled at because they spent too much in the cloud that month? Who's been yelled at by security because something may have gotten pushed out with a policy that it didn't need or put credentials in a PowerShell script that shouldn't have been there on that network share. Um, anyways, or of course, like, we always have to make the ever popular middle management happy. We all know that they're important. We all know they have jobs to do. They're going to run a bunch of reports. They're going to make sure that they get paid for stuff. And, you know, not getting yelled at by finance, not getting yelled at by security, making sure that the middle manager keeps signing your paycheck. You know, these are things that are super important. You like easy, you want to be lazy, but how? You have so much stuff that's already deployed that you don't have tags on. And really, you know, that's not a huge deal. You don't have to freak out about it. It can seem daunting, but all you have to do is get organized. We all know that DevOps is bringing people, process, and tooling together to be successful. You can't just buy a CI CD pipeline and expect to be successful. Um, it was the great Matty Stratton that said, you can't buy DevOps, but I can sell it to you. And it's absolutely right. Like, it, it kind of takes that wholesale people process and tools. There's tooling to help. Everybody needs to be on board with it. You need to kind of go through that process. DevOps is a marathon, not a sprint. Like, everybody's seen, you know, images like this. And, you know, some people may be there. Some people may not be there. Knowing how to get from where you are to where you need to go is just realizing that every six months, that picture is going to change. There's going to be new logos. You just kind of have to keep moving and keep taking steps in the right direction. So going through, taking the tools, taking the process, taking the people, taking the everything to try to come to that, the easiest way to do it is just baby steps. Start right now today. Every new thing that goes out the door into the cloud, tag it, period. So you're immediately going to take the backlog that you have right now, and it's going to stop. You're not going to get any bigger. You're just going to keep start, you know, go out there, tag. Maybe you just start adding tags of this is all my prod stuff. This is all my dev stuff. You're just taking those little incremental steps to get to where you want. And then eventually you can start working on that backlog of tag everything with prod, tag everything as a web server. Kind of start with the big circles, making those circles smaller incremental little steps through the process will get you where you eventually want to be. But how do you make it even easier than that? We want to be even lazier than doing that. Good question. I'm glad you asked. <laughs> so there is so much tooling out there to kind of help you get where you want to go. If you're using Terraform, there's things like TerraTag and Your by Bridge Crew to help you automate that process of tagging during the deployment process. If you're using Terraform's AWS provider, there's native tagging built right in. In Windows and stuff like that, there's also you know, tools. But remember, 
go out of your way today to be lazy tomorrow. It's the American way, that's what we're here for, right? <laughs> Hopefully that was helpful. Appreciate y'all.